guys thank you so much for returning back to the channel today is going to be part two of my back to school prep and today we are prepping for first grade i cannot believe this you guys my boys grades are just blowing me away so if you missed the previous video i talked all about what my fifth grader is taking to fifth grade they're going back to school no remote um from home no going to the school with their electronics working virtually everything is full blown back to school regular and i'm so excited the kids needed this and you guys just pray they have a great first day of school so we're going to get into what trey is taking he's going to the first grade <laughs> and uh, if you miss what julian is taking again watch the previous video or i'll link it in the description of the video for you guys all right so we're gonna go ahead and get started so this is trey's lunch bag he chose minecraft as you can see he's starting to get into this big boy phase especially with him having a big brother so this is his lunch bag and uh it's just a little minecraft and then he has a hand sanitizer that i put on his lunch bag just like i did with julian's just so he can get that extra sanitary in i'm pretty sure they're going to wash their hands and do their best to stay covid 19 free but it wouldn't hurt to just add an extra incentive you know so yeah, that's his lunch bag. And then he has the matching backpack, which is also Minecraft as well. Everything has been washed, sprayed down. And I just can't believe Trey is going to the first grade, y'all. <laughs> it didn't hit me until I had to buy these items right here, the composition book and the notebook. So he did need one composition book. So he got one of those. And he also needed the notebooks. The one subject wire rule 70 sheet notebook so he has one in green and he also has one in blue and i'm like oh my goodness he really is a big boy <laughs> um he needed pencils so we got two boxes of the jot number two pencils he also needed some scissors we got a two pack of those a pair in green and a pair in yellow so we got some scissors he also needed two things of Kleenex. So I found the ones that had the little characters on them. Um, one is a Mickey Mouse and it's just, you know, different little Mickey character faces on it. And then I got another one with the Toy Story faces on it. So he needed Kleenex. Next, he needed some sandwich bags. So I just got some regular sandwich bags for him. He also needed some of these markers, uh, the dry erase markers that is, and it's in the color black. He also needed a pencil pouch, so I got him one in green. He also needed some markers, so I just got him the washable markers. It's an eight count, different colors. Moving on, he needed crayons. Um, he needed three boxes of crayons. So I got the Crayola crayons. They color the best to me, so it doesn't get like smeared or anything. So he has three boxes of the Crayola crayons. You know, they make the crayons in so many different styles now, but I like to stick to the original brand because that's what really works. <laughs> um, he also needed some glue sticks, so we got the Jot glue sticks and moving over here he needed erasers so I've got a pack of erasers and it is a six count of pink erasers and then last but not least he needed some disinfectant wipes so I got some um, that were the Lysol disinfectant wipes and that's pretty much everything that you needed for first grade. And then, of course, we got the board that I showed you all in the last video. But in case you missed it, I'll show you again. This board right here, it says first day of, of course, school. I am blank years old. I want to be blank when I grow up. My teacher is blah, blah, blah. My favorite activity is blah, blah, blah. The date is blah, blah, blah. So him and Julian can both share this and take pictures on the first day of school everything that you see here just like with my fifth grader um everything that you see on this table for my first grader 
is from Dollar Tree, okay? So please don't think you got to break the bank to get school supplies. You'll probably be so happy and very fortunate that you go into your Dollar Tree or even Target Dollar Spot, okay? Or even the Walmart Dollar Spot and get a lot of these items. They were really affordable at the Dollar Tree. So yeah, y'all excuse me, I'm out of breath, I'm pregnant. <laughs> but yeah, this is everything that my first grader is taking for back to school. I cannot believe, again, he's going to the first grade. I'm so happy for him and so excited because preschool, he got a chance to experience preschool and what it's like being in the elementary, but then we, sh we all shut down for COVID and he was full blown virtual for kindergarten. So I am so excited that, you know, he'll get a chance to get back into the physical classroom and just do his thing. So yeah, you guys, let me know what you think about today's video. Give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and let me know how are you prepping for your uh, first grader to go back to school? Does your first grader need similar items, lesser items? Would you shop at the Dollar Tree for your items? Let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all in the next upload. Bye guys.